found something really interesting uh, so this is actually an NATN automation if you and if you don't have any technical experience you can follow along with this tutorial because it is trial friendly and it is also really non technical friendly so let's start um anything is really simple you just create an account in na10.io and it's completely free for 15 days then uh, you can come here and then you can go and add your first step right so this is not anything complicated again you go and then you can you just need to write whatsapp bot whatsapp business cloud actually once you have done that you have triggers and actions now let me explain to you the difference between triggers and actions so triggers are like um which something which triggers that thing like that module so for an example the one we are going to use which is on messages so let me just click that right now so this is this spark means it's a trigger that it triggers up just like lights when you switch on the lights it triggers up and then you know you have lighting in your room it happens just it's like that, I go to but and this write is what's on a message that right? hello what's up it's written that it gets triggered trigger on then messages it, it sends it sends it to the right and so when a trigger is there the next one to it will be an action so you can't have a trigger inside a trigger so um here yeah, let's go actually you need to connect your whatsapp oauth account yeah so you just have to go and click on this whatsapp trigger uh it should be on messages because that's what we want to use and then you need to create a new credential if you have never done this whatsapp trigger or actions so you go and create one right and now you will ask okay how will i get my client id and client secret let's open the docs so for any module they have these docs which helps you so the first thing is you need to have a meta developer account then you need to create a meta business portfolio and then a meta business app configured with whatsapp great uh so actually you can just click these links and then you get steps to from where to create them and then you also get uh like where to get these api keys and stuff you should never say share your api keys your client id client secret this is what is here client id client secret so i have followed this drop uh, docs word by word so that i can create this whatsapp worth account and now this is really simple once you, once you have connected this you're almost free because you have to just create the second step which is AI agent, right? AI agent. So go AI agent, and you need to go and do this to define below. Great. So uh, now what you need to do is you go and write here that uh, this is you are a helpful assistant actually. So you have to go and write. Actually, uh, there's a tool called Whisper Flow which lets you uh you know when you say something it turns it into text but how do you activate that after downloading just press the function key so i have i just transcribed this right so actually i'm gonna add these here yeah so now to actually get this like you also want to give the chatbot that what is the name of who's talking right so for that uh you need to actually execute previous nodes so that it can understand that hey these are all whatsapp outputted and then i can drag them in so let me just show you how if it's complicated for you actually you need to disconnect this so uh, because this has errors right because this is not connected so now you execute the workflow and you need to wait for a trigger event it's waiting for a trigger event the, so this means it's waiting for a trigger so oh no i'm triggered with that lightning spark there so let me actually show you so when you put your client id and um client secret there you will also get to put your uh what is your number right so you can put that there and also give a test number which you'll have to message so so let me show you right so 
page so i have connected with it and i have named it my whatsapp bot so i'm just going to write hi to it it got triggered and it executed successfully now we can connect this and then see now this is what it all output it so we can use them so what do you mean how we can use them you're gonna ask me so actually you know what i'm gonna move this to the side again then you're gonna go here and you have a lot of things right you have a body and you have a type field or uh, you have name okay you have name here which we need it actually so you're gonna put this inside this why is it red oh this is got red i got scared okay drag this in and let me remove this quotation marks then i'm gonna drag this in so actually the name whatsapp actually uh, automatically detects what's your name right so from that it can actually give an output that who are you like you can also confirm that it's your number because it's gonna put the name and now you're gonna put your body which is actually i just wrote hi to it so here it's saying showing that hey uh i wrote hi to it so we have put this and now you just can go and test this step but before that you need to put a chat model so if you if you're thinking that hey i'm going technical let me bring you back that we have connected whatsapp we are, we are connecting an edge and we give it a prompt just like you give a prompt to chat gpt now we're going to connect a model to this so you have open ai you have google you have grok and all these different llms so the easiest one i feel which is there is open router and it's like completely free you go to open router.ai and you get a new api key for yourself go to open router and here on the top right you can go and go to keys right and you can search models so if you want some paired model you can go and you can search paired models and if you want free models you just write free these are all the free models which are there but i know it is really 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 tough to find free models like this so the easiest there are two ones one is deep seek which i stopped using because i got a new one which i'm going to tell you so see this is deep seek free and now i'm going to tell the latest the best model which is for free and that's by llama so you just write llama it's not 3.3 .3 instruct it is for maverick which they're giving free you also have scout but i use maverick um so you're just gonna gonna need to go and you need to write maverick free okay now you're gonna go out of this and you have connected your open router this is really cool now your ai agent will work and now the last step you need to do is go ahead this is the last second step actually because you need to go and test the step right mm -hmm. here you go so this is the input this is the output so hello uh, so it's saying my name hello tharva kumar how are you today is there something i can help you with or you would like to chat with so now what i can do is i can go and add simple memory to this so i can actually give this and this below the session id and i think you can keep the key whatever you want you can give a nice context window length so context window is how many messages you're going to remember so let me give 15 because 15 will be enough for me for now and i can go and put this in place and now i can add a new one which is our last step so you have to write whatsapp again and you have actions you can't choose triggers right now because i said you can't add it to get any trigger so you need to have an action you need to have an action so let me just click on send message because we need that yeah so for this you can again go into docs and then you need to figure out your access token and your business account id again you need to open these docs to figure it, it out yourself now um i'm gonna send this so guys i've connected my uh things as i've showed you and you only have three simple steps but this is going to be so powerful actually for you guys because we want to test our workflow this is going to be so cool
so make sure you watch till we have the output so we have executed the workflow so let me show you i'm gonna write hello there right i wrote hello there okay it went to the ai it went to the simple memory it's going to the whatsapp business cloud here okay so it's taking some time in writing actually and saving it into the memory so that hey it came hello atharva kumar hello atharva kumar it's nice to meet you how can i assist you today and it has memory so if i ask what's 2 plus 2 right what's 2 plus 2 oh i have i have to actually run this again my bad let me run this great so i ran this and it came hello atharva kumar the answer to 2 plus 2 is 4 but here's the interesting part i'm going to write what were let me just write it what were we we talking about i was it what were you talking about and uh, we were discussing about we we were discussing about what is 2 plus 2 and yeah then you ask what were you talking about and now i'm just telling you so it has the full memory it can actually tell its memory itself like it can tell what memory it like just gathered from the conversation we had this is so cool uh let's just save it i forgot to save it in the middle but no worries because i've made it successfully with no internet breaks so i have to save it so yeah uh, i hope you like this tutorial bye guys see you next time peace